All right, out with the old. I'm gonna take this down, and we're gonna put our thankful tree up. Happy Halloween, everybody. It's Saturday, we are making pancakes. I just have the Bisquick mix here. I'm gonna put a little bit of uh, orange in it just to make it a little more festive. And we'll mix that up and get going on our little pumpkin shake pancakes, waffles. I don't know, whatever this is. Okay, we have our yummy pancake breakfast. Here? This is just regular pancakes. I just dyed them orange. Let me see your Halloween shirt. I got these for them last year. They're huge. Koi, uh, Mayor has Minecraft. Koi, what do you have? Spider-Man. Let me see. Come over here and get your food. Show me your shirt. Oh, super cool. I have Koi's laundry here. I got a fold. Merritt says in the dryer still. Oh, you're going to have syrup? Mary? you usually don't do that. Still Being a little wacky because it's Halloween. Okay, they're gonna eat and then I'm gonna get ready. Okay, good morning everybody. It's more like noon now because I spent three hours trying to get my hair look decent. I wanted to curl it because it's Halloween and I don't know, just feeling fun today, but it is not near as cute as it was when my hair was long. I feel like curly suit going on here, but whatever, it's fine. Maybe it'll fall a little bit as the day goes on. I just have my Halloween shirt on, Wolfman, Mummy, Frankenstein, and Dracula, the little cardigan, and then of course I have to show you my Mavis earrings. I pulled out my Halloween earrings and asked the boys, which one should I wear? Of course, they picked Mavis. Okay, I am going to Pinterest my hair, y'all. It's like, <laughs> I'm going <pin, laughs> to Pinterest some recipes for these pumpkin seeds that the boys are dying to do. Everything that I've seen so far says they're so good, so maybe it'll be worth it, but I'm going to do that. And then I pulled out some, this is the leftover pancakes that Craig didn't eat. I pulled out these because I had forgotten we still had some M&Ms, some Halloween M&Ms. So I wanted to use those today. And I didn't have sugar cookie mix, but I had peanut butter. So I thought, oh, we'll just make some cookies and that'll be fun and I'll let them do it. So we'll do that. But first I'm going to try to figure out what to do with the pumpkin seeds. Okay, more changes to the hair. I couldn't do it in the face. So I just pulled it up and kind of put it in a little ponytail holder <laughs> okay i am just realizing i look so different um i'm just realizing that you have to boil these seeds before you can do anything i guess so i'm gonna boil them koi says i made the mistake of like saying all these seasonings you could put on them and he, koi wants pizza so i don't even know if i have that is that just probably like oregano and basil maybe i don't know and then Merritt said he wanted just plain salty and i would kind of like to have like a pumpkin-y kind of spice flavor but i didn't get all the seeds because it would just take me forever so we'll just maybe break them up into thirds and see how it goes okay y'all i hope i'm doing this right boiling them in some salt water this is totally last minute i should have planned a little better but we did peaches with the pumpkin uh, ghost and a cat in the nuggets and then some ketchup and some little Cheez-Its. They'll think it's fun even though it's not like super well thought out. <laughs> Lunch is served! Lunch is served. Thank you mama for the fun lunch. Have you been missing it? Yes. Yeah. It's what? It's Mavis. It's Mavis. Did you get a Mavis too, Koi? Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Have you been missing fun lunch too? Yeah, Mama got worn out of it, didn't she? Good? They're really going now, y'all. <laughs> All right, they are boiled. I'm just letting them drain a minute. Then the recipe that I found said to use, this was from lunch, um, sea salt and olive oil and a little garlic. So I thought we would just do sea salt and olive oil for like the ones who don't want to get too crazy. And then we'll just do ranch instead of the pizza kind. I think that will taste really good. And then we won't do like a sweet pumpkin pie one. That's fine. Cause we really don't have that many. Um, we're having, Craig and I are having lasagna <laughs> left over. I was going to show you this. Craig just brought the mail in and Merritt's little polo shirt just came in. Craig, uh, Craig Coy already had the Navy and Merritt has a gray one similar to this, but it's like a waffle knit. And I kind of wanted him to have one of these. I might try to find another one too these are so good for like fall winter spring 
for church because they can wear like whatever underneath like a button up or just like a polo t-shirt or whatever underneath it doesn't matter and then they don't have to worry about tucking in because if you know little boys and keeping shirts tucked it is just a pain and then you're constantly tucking their shirts in but now this they can wear and they can still wear their little belt buckles like they like to wear to church and it kind of just looks really cute so now Merritt has the red and Koi has the navy super cute super cute just went back to their rooms and set their stuff out for church tomorrow and I got to thinking I have not gotten them anything yet for like their Christmas outfits and that red really is like a pretty Christmas kind of cranberry red it might look nice with I think Merritt has a plaid red shirt already button up that he wore last year last year they had black polo McCoy, Merritt had a black polo sweater like a thicker sweater which they wore last week to church so they can still wear those but but um and Koi had a gray did I say that Merritt had the black and Koi had the gray and Koi had like kind of a blue red it still looked Christmassy but it had blues in it because y'all know he loves blue last year for Christmas and then Merritt had the red I just don't know whether I want to like buy something all new because I don't even know right now we don't even really know if they're gonna have a Christmas program they're definitely not having one at school so that's off and they're kind of trying to decide now I think last I heard uh, if we were gonna do one at church or not I mean I still want them to look nice when we go to church before Christmas but I don't know I'm thinking that red might look nice and then Koi could wear his navy and that might just be Christmas outfits y'all <laughs> So this is kind of what I was thinking in my head. This underneath what she wore last year. Does that matter? Um, it's still plenty big. Yeah, it's a 7.8, so it'll fit him. And then this over top. Um, I don't know. Is that too much red? He really doesn't have any other button ups. Otherwise, um, where are his? Oh, I think that's in my closet. He's got another red. Hang on, let me grab that. His other red shirts are in my closet because I was trying to figure out what we were going to wear for our family pictures that we don't even know yet. But I think I am going to wear, well, I don't, we don't know when we're doing them yet. I, mean, I kind of want to do them in the snow, so we'll see. Probably should have done them this last snow, but it's all melted now. This is my shirt. And then Craig is going to wear just this green shirt with like a sweater over top. And I have this one for Mare or this black, or I think that black was Koi's or this red or this um, for the boys. They can kind of mix and match now, especially for a picture, just for a few minutes to wear each other's shirts or just kind of do whatever. But this might actually look cuter under that shirt. Or I could just have him just wear this, nice and starch the jeans and a buckle and that be his Christmas too. And Koi could maybe even wear this. I don't know. I just, what I'm getting at is I don't think I need to buy anything this year. Did I really just say that? I don't need to buy anything this year? Have I gone mad? <laughs> this was Koi's. And see, it still sort of looks Christmassy. And it was in the children's place like Christmas line, you know, like their Christmas items. And it, I think this would actually look really good with the navy this year too. So we might just do that. Um, the navy and the red. I think I might like that, y'all. I think it's cute. Well, I was recording that for y'all and it cut off because my SD card was full and I need to erase some stuff and my hands are all nasty. So, I think I'm going to change the parchment sheet so it's nice and fresh and it doesn't have the olive oil all over it and then I'm going to pop them in the oven. Boys are out here in the car cleaning it out so that we can go trick or treat. We usually, like, usually I think I said this, Craig is usually not with us. Um, and so I will just like drive along the little streets and then they will climb out and go both ways, like whichever side has a, is that customary? I don't know how this works, but, uh, like you're, if your light is on, then you're won't trick or treaters. Like, is that a thing everywhere? Probably so. Anyway, <laughs> so if we see a light, then we'll go and I just drive along real slow and they get out either side of the car. And so it has to be like clean so that Koi can either come across Merritt's side or Merritt can go across Koi's side. So that's what they're doing now. Good way to get your car clean, y'all. Go trick or treat. <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all. These are so stinking good. I think I might like just the salty ones the best. Why didn't I do more? I had a bunch of, um, I was gonna say salt seeds left and I was just over it. It is not easy to get all the seeds out of that pumpkin stuff. Like, that's like gold back there. So they better not waste it. <laughs> It is good though. I think it'll be a new tradition. Maybe next year we'll try some of the pumpkin spice stuff. They're still cleaning out the car. When they get done, we're going to bake the cookies. And then I have them a little Halloween surprise for, you know, the last day of our countdown. It wouldn't fit in the countdown. So 
I made it the Halloween surprise. I have a Halloween surprise for you. Thank you. Can I open it? Thank do you. you. <laughs> do you know what that is? Yeah. A fire surprise. No, what is it? It's a mystery pumpkin. It's a Ryan pumpkin. A Ryan mystery pumpkin. Have you had one of those before? No. What's this? Hey, it has holes in it. <gasps> it must be mini something boos. alive. Mini mini boos. Is that what they're called? Mini boos. Mini boos. What are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? I think I'm more excited than y'all are. <laughs> we know. Okay, we got fetch. Oh, okay. He got. I don't know who these things are. This is something from Ryan's, Ryan's World. But these are the ones we got. They're like dressed up like Halloween characters. I have no idea. Skyler. All right, Merritt got the little manatee seal, Wait. whatever. Oh, she's. It's like fuzzy. And Koizy got this amethyst. Is her name amethyst? Purple. Sorry, my battery died. I'm having some technical difficulties today. Anyway, this is one that Koi got. They're gonna go put this stuff away, and then we're gonna taste test the pumpkin seeds. Okay. Merritt, you start. These are the ranch and these are the salt. Salt first. Okay. Oh, that's so good. Just do it. <laughs> good, right? Now try the ranch. Did you try the ranch? Mm-hmm. I think I like the salt better. The ranch is good too though. Cole, are you ready? Yeah. Is this the pizza? Yeah, try it. Let me have this football. Which is okay. mine. It's ranchy pizza. <laughs> They're good, aren't they? What do you think about the ranch one, Mary? I kind of like a mix together, a salt and a yeah. ranch together. Do you like them, Koi? New tradition? I think, I think I like the ranch a little bit better. I'm glad y'all talked me into doing it. <laughs> oh! You don't like the salt? Is it too salty? I wondered if it would be too like salty it. for you. I like it. What doesn't like a lot of salt? How about try a salt and a ranch together to kind of even it out, maybe? Oh. Just let me get a cup of water. You need a little water? Okay, I'm going to get all this cookie stuff ready to go. Okay, cookie time. Here, Koi. You want to pour that in for us? All of it? Yep, I'm just going to let them do this. See how it goes. Okay, they did a pretty good job, I think. We are go we kind of flattened them out and smoothed them out a little bit. We're gonna put them in the oven, bake them up, and then we'll have a nice treat. Cookies are baking away. We're gonna do a little work on our fall puzzle. All done, and they smell so yummy. We're all gonna have a little relax time for about an hour before we go trick or treat. And they chose to watch the original Adams Family like from when I was a kid. It, I think it's just recently out on Netflix or Prime, both maybe. So that is what we're watching. I don't think I'm gonna have time to do this, but this is our thankful tree that will start tomorrow. I might have time, we'll see. They're trying to get dressed now, but I just cut these leaves out with my Cricut. Hopefully I'll have enough for this year. My little cutting machine. And then I put a big chalkboard tree on here and then every night we use, let me find the glue dots. Oh, I don't know where they are. I'll have to find them later. Oh. <laughs> glue dots and then we shirt. glue. It's over there. It's your, it's got like a gorilla or something on it. We glue the leaves onto this? the tree. Yes. And then before we glue the, before they put the leaves up, they put something they're thankful for on the little leaf. And then by the end of November, we have a full tree of leaves. This is one of our fun little Thanksgiving traditions. All right, out with the old. I'm gonna take this down. And we're gonna put our thankful tree up. Okay, it's up on the wall. I just keep the little baggie with the things right here and then they can grab it and it's got a pin in it somewhere right there. And they'll be ready for every evening in November. 
give thanks y'all okay everybody's almost ready to go mccoy has a hole in his sock so he's gonna go change that uh i just had a a uh, message on instagram yes i'm trying to fix my hair about that game we played yesterday called noisy persons and I told you that my sister got it at Ollie's, but I did search it on Amazon and it's on Amazon for 11 bucks. I don't know if it's worth that. I would probably buy it for 11 bucks because my boys thought it was fun. But um, if you were looking for it, you can get it on Amazon. Noisy persons. I don't know about the Zed the zombie. I didn't look that up. She was just wondering about the card game. So there you go. We're all ready to go trick or treat. <laughs> all right, we're off. I decided to wear my little hat. I don't think I'll actually get out of the car, but whatever. Um, they are ready. We're gonna go to Craig's grandma's first. She lives in one town over. Um, I think we can just kind of like trick or treat through the door with her to stay like um, social distance and everything. But we'll at least get to see her and she'll get to see the boys in their costumes. And then we'll head back to town and go to all the houses. Ah, oh, it's so bright! You are. Wow. <laughs> what are you saying? Yeah, trick or treat, how about that? <laughs> you better help yourself. Did you just tell me? We need caffeine to keep us up. You need caffeine to keep you awake. I don't think you've ever need anything to keep you awake. Who's your favorite mama? You. Who's your favorite parent? You. Oh, Diet Ball. Coke for everybody. <laughs> All right, this football player's telling us to go in. <laughs> we want the candy, we want the candy. Oh, that is creepy. Oh, is that a person in that thing? Yeah, but see. Is that his feet? That's his feet. See, he's <laughs> looking out the star on the top. <laughs> <That's funny. laughs> Trick or treat. Right. Trick or treat. Two, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, I like your costumes. Thank you. Are you All right. Revolutionary War? Oh, I was wondering if you're yeah. a Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. What'd you get? What'd you get? Nothing. <laughs> What's in there, Koi? A princess yo yo. <laughs> what? Princess Let me yo -yo? see. <laughs> Hand it to me. He's gotten oh, girl stuff all day. Princess. What else? Okay, what else? Ooh, a toothbrush. A toothbrush. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, fangs. Frightening. Merritt, what are you getting over there? Anything? Can you get them in your mouth? All kind of goodies. A little sack of candy. All kind of fun stuff in here. They even got little Legos. How fun. That was a good stop. This guy always scares the kids. <laughs> oh gracious. You were scared? Did he scare you? Because smoke was coming out of that door, making real weird noises. And somebody <laughs> opened up the door with a creepy blue mask. <laughs> Are y'all having so much fun? Yeah. yeah. But not much. But what? Not many lights are on. I think your bag is almost full already, McCoy. Why is that sign lying down right there? I don't know. Merit, the Sanderson sisters. Sanderson. Cutest costume ever. Hocus Pocus. I have no idea what we're talking about. <laughs> Who are you? Uh, they're walking along the sidewalk down Merit. to another house. Wait for him. <laughs> oh, to be young again. Merritt just came to the window. Did you see the three witches? <laughs> we have already had to dump their pumpkins out into plastic bags so that they could get more candy. Oh All my right. gosh. There they go. I just had to dump their buckets out again. <laughs> it's getting so much candy. It's so much fun. Now they found some friends. They're walking around with Cole. Craig, do you love trick-or-treating? Yep. It's so much fun, isn't it? Have you missed it all these years? <laughs> Merritt, 
They just got full size bars. The Ooh, first crunch. ones of the night. I got two. And apparently <laughs> Koi's favorite is the Nestle Crunch now. So that was a good deal for you, right Koi? Are you getting tired yet? Yeah. <laughs> what awesome. Wait. <laughs> Okay, it's starting to get dark. You know the routine for Halloween. We always go to Craig's mom's grandma's house. Craig's mom's, their grandma's house, and they hand out candy the last little bit of, I talk too fast, the last little bit of trick-or-treating. They love that. And then we're gonna have chili, and then we're gonna head home. Oh my gosh, we thought we were done, but we've got to go to this house. Yo, boys. Wow. Oh, you yeah, have to. totally need to bring the Guns. Yeah, you better bring your guns. Oh my gosh. Sorry. Look. Oh, did you shut the door? Oh, there's like stuff in the windows too. You have to walk through that cat. <laughs> Don't be scared. Go, boys. You guys want to make a deal? Who is that talking? Oh my god. Wait, I gotta zoom in. Is that like Beetlejuice? <laughs> he said, give me a high five and I'll tell you where the candy is. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm scared for him. I'm scared for them. <laughs> my battery's gonna go dead of all times. Is there a chainsaw? Hey, don't be a chicken. You gotta go. Oh gosh, <laughs> they're gonna have nightmares. <laughs> hey, don't move, Craig, because I'm leaning on you. Oh my God, that's so much crazy. Oh my God. <laughs> we might be bad parents for this. Are they coming out? Oh, there they go. They better get a full-size candy bar for that. <laughs> Merit's not going back through there. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Were you scared? No. What happened? Was it scary? Oh, dude. <laughs> what? Look at that window. I know. Isn't that scary? Were you, what did they do, Merritt? Was there a chainsaw? Yeah. And you had to oh, walk boy, through that, that thing? Look at that window up there. Creepy. Yeah, I saw the skeleton. Yeah. Who was no, that Beetlejuice the... talking to you? I guess y'all don't know what Beetlejuice is, do you? No. <gasps> oh. Was he scary? <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> no. Give us the sweets. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Did you see those baskets just leaving? Yeah. Oh, they got the last of the candy. It's good. Sorry. Yeah, it's it's well, then we can just give everybody some. <laughs> Trick or treat? Oh, you could take your costume off. Okay. You're welcome. I gotta spin. Is there more? Somebody's riding in the cart behind us. Oh no! Jeez! You haven't gotten one yet, Koi. Here comes somebody, Koi. Merritt, let Koi do it. Mia, did you grab one? Oh, never mind. Oh, she got one already. I didn't even hear the bell ring. Did you just see it come up? Oh. All of Merritt's loot. You got you got bubbles too somewhere, didn't you, Merritt? Yeah, right here. All of Koi's loot. They trick or treated till they dropped. This is our loot. Your loot. Was it so much fun? Yeah. Yeah. Did you love having Daddy with us this year? No. Oh, why not? I'm just kidding. Just kidding. No, they broke into the fun dip. It's a delicious. Yum. Do you eat that white stick too? Yeah. <laughs> all right, y'all, we are home. I just went through all the candy and put it in their buckets and took it out of their little Halloween things. They got nasty this year. Their little, the little tops, the handles to their pumpkins are gross. I guess I'm gonna have to wash them. I hope they can be washed. I don't know. They've had these. My mama got them these um, when Merritt was born and then she got Koi's when his was born. I don't know if you have, uh, Maybe I can just spot clean it. Uh, if you have these for your kids, let me know. <laughs> anyway, 
Um, the boys are finished up watching Adam's Family. I'm exhausted. It is 8.39. We have church in the morning, so I'm gonna end this one here. Thanks so much for following us along on this fun Halloween day. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a thing, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all. <laughs>